I'm Clinton Griffiths with today's Ag Day Minute. One group is releasing its annual list. It calls the Shopper's Guide to Pesticides and Produce. The Environmental Working Group releasing its so-called Dirty Dozen Produce that it claims have the most pesticides. As in 2022, strawberries and spinach came out on top, followed by kale, collard, and mustard. Now, it claims to have pulled information from USDA data, but Chris Novak, the president and CEO of Crop Life America, says the report quote, willfully misrepresents the USDA information, adding, quote, that farmers use pesticides to control insects and fungal diseases that threaten the healthfulness and safety of fruits and vegetables, end quote. A Chicago man is suing Buffalo Wild Wings, saying its boneless wings actually contain breast meat. In a cheeky tweet, the company notes they didn't contain buffalo either. The plaintiff's lawsuit says the products are more like chicken nuggets and claims calling them wings is fraud. His attorney is seeking other potential clients who feel the same way after eating them. And how would you like to take part in a historic cattle drive and get paid to do it? The famous Fort Worth herd is looking for people who are interested in working as a drover. They're the folks in charge of recreating historic cattle drives through the Fort Worth stockyards. Drovers will be paid up to $20 an hour. You have to be over 18 years old. To apply, check out fortworth.com. For more Ag News, watch Ag Day weekdays on the station or anytime at agweb.com.